Hey, what is up guys, Yeti here, welcome back to episode 2 of Gods Will Be Watching. In the last episode, we came close to beating chapter 1 twice, but we didn't didn't quite make it. Um, if you didn't see the last episode, you probably should go watch it, so that you understand what's going on here, because I am pretty much just going to get straight into this. So, let's go ahead and hack the corridor, and we will charge it once, and then negotiate them to stay there. So yeah, the, the, the first time was the time we got closer, and that was before I even knew about fully what was going on. She's getting a little react, re relax. he's getting a little agitated, but it doesn't look too bad so far. Let's charge it. They're not relaxed yet. Let's reinforce the security. Yeah. Everyone seems very relaxed. You're the most relaxed, so you're gonna get shouted down. Hopefully that'll calm every that'll annoy everyone else. He's starting to get a little agitated, but not too much. Talking to your dudes seems to just be like a sort of combination of flavor text and maybe things that are a little bit useful. Um because in in the original game your dudes were obviously gonna your dudes are sort of the ones that were stressing out. So you need to keep your dudes sort of contained and stuff. Right, hack it. Let's see if outside they move forward. They didn't move forward. Let's negotiate again. To keep them going. 100% success rate. Oh, fuck. I wasn't paying attention. So it's going to be a nice boost. Everyone needs to stop being so chill. There we go. Charge it and then reinforce it. Okay, you, 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 you can go to the break room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he is so about to attack. They are very relaxed. One of you needs to get kicked, I'm afraid. Oh, fuck. Oh, the guess me it every time. It's way more aggressive than I think, right? Negotiate. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, I'm not distracted. When they get close, I'm going to send them a, a trade, I think. Right, there we go. I don't know who, though. One of these two. These two are the dickheads. Right, you get back here. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, everyone's so relaxed. No, I'm not, you cunt. You are way too relaxed. One of these is going to get kicked. They are right outside. Let's negotiate and then I'll shout at them a bunch. Try and get them up double legged. Right. Reinforce. And then I want to get a charge going. Get another charge. Shout at them. Negotiate. Tell them to make sure they stay there. And then... I think we're gonna... Trade one of them out. Right, let me make sure that they're, they're both only half. And then I am gonna trade to send them back. Ask them to go back. Okay. Now she is about to go, so she's going to get kicked. I don't see any reason to shoot them. Beyond stopping them from running. Yo, you, stay the fuck there. Uh, everyone's getting so relaxed. And they're stepping forward, so let's negotiate. And you relax a little. Oh, fuck, dude. I'm just aware that we aren't making much progress in the way of hacking here. She is so relaxed and it's stressing me out, dude. Should we just keep shouting at her for a bit? There we go.
Oh, he's about to hang himself. Okay, and we're going for it. We're going for one. Please work. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. We did it. Let's get out of here. Let's, let's go. You'll never leave this place alive. Oh, please don't say we all just die anyway. Oh, the ringing. Ow, fuck, dude. Abraham. Jack. Drop your weapon. Liam. Get away. Lead the revolution. Don't worry about us. We've been through worse. I won't let you die here, I promise. Whatever, just go. Oh, fuck, you got killed, dude. Achievement unlocked. We're not terrorists. I didn't start my stopwatch. B chapter 1 in easy difficulty. Gallery alternative soundtrack. Keep all hostages alive. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they, they all were alive. One of them just got traded. Okay. Oh, dude, this is so cool. Dude, look at all these stats. Oh, my God, the replay value. You killed zero hostages. 34 didn't kill any. 33 killed one hostage. 20% killed two, and 11% killed three. So I'm sort of more with the majority there who didn't kill any, although some killed one. That's probably when they try to escape, more than, more than likely. You freed one hostage. 23% freed one. Not many freed the rest of them. Your favorite demand is with guards retreat. Network ability and medicine. When, what do they use medicine for? I, I can't figure out what you need it for. Oh, I guess if you're on a harder difficulty and you need to like shoot people on the legs and stuff. Um, 66 tried to res 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 words escape, 33 rebelled, and I got none of that. You didn't fight with Jack. 81% didn't have conflict, 12% reprimanded, 6 apologised. Oh, what? When does Jack fight with you? Maybe again on a harder difficulty? Maybe things need to be balanced a bit then if like most people don't even fight with him. I didn't even know you could fight with him. 93% soft. Okay. Well, that was interesting to look at. Chapter 2. 20 days of empty words. So I'm just going to keep going and pretty much just stop every 20 minutes or so, even if we're in the middle of missions, just because with the nature of the game, that seems to work the best. Okay, that ship looks kind of Lego-ish, which is pretty cool. I like it. Illuminati! Uh, this is Sergeant Bird in communications within the battleship, requesting an equipped Type 6 comm relay um, to the Everdust Company for the Knowledge Universe. In it, secure channel 6. Sergeant, it's been three months since your last transmission. The mission protocol dictates at least a report every two weeks. It wasn't my choice here, there's been a lot of activity in Denolva recently. Sergeant, our intel indicates that the Medus Medusia virus has fallen into the, the hands of Denolva. What happened? It hasn't yet calmed down. Liam is planning to assault one of the holistics. Um, Empire's space labs. The plan is to seal their research data about the Medusia virus. This is unacceptable burden, as an elephant must not gain access to the Medusia virus. They've gone too far this time. Sergeant, these are your new orders. Eliminate Liam and sabotage his plans. Sir, killing an elephant leader isn't the solution. It's, uh, that course of action will blow up a three-year operation. Jack and I have worked hard to earn Liam's trust. Within a few months, we could have achieved a peaceful end to this an elephant organization. Have you lost your mind, Sergeant? We could never allow a terrorist organization access to a weapon of mass destruction. As an author aren't terrorists, they have an ideal of revolution, but Liam isn't genocidal, I know him, sir. Keep talking like that and we'll consider your loyalty compromised. As an author and the enemy must be neutralized by any means necessary. We need more time. Sergeant, listen to me. I'll take responsibility for what action as an author carries out with the Medusia virus. <laughs> Kills the entire universe. The time comes, my hand won't hesitate to put a bullet in Liam's head, but killing Fungronk Gru will only unleash a war between which will cost Everdusk resources and lives. Trust me, I have this under control. Okay. Shower time. Sorry, did I wake you? What's up? You look confused. Let us introduce ourselves. My name is Irving. The big boy with the funny helmet is Alexander. He doesn't speak much, he is, but he's a good fella. Uh, that is unless you piss him off, but that ain't gonna happen. Am I right? Am I right? Hueyo! Let me just move a mic here so I can stretch slightly whilst I do this cutscene. Um... Cut the crap, what do you want? Relax, you don't want to push things here, trust me. My boss wants to know about you, the usual drill, age, sex, location, etc. Oh, and also, he wants to know what the fuck you're doing in our lab. So anyway, first question, how did you manage to enter our space lab? Okay, let me just scan the room a bit here. See if there's anything going on, doesn't seem like it. So I guess our options are... Provoke, beg, think, 10% chance to lie or confess. 
They all take time. What, what can Jack do? The same. Wait, is that the same? There's five options. Yeah, the same. Okay. Um, let's provoke him slightly. <laughs> A little bitch like you won't get much from us. Is there some kind of secret entrance to our space labs that I'm not aware of? Um, let's ask Hobson. <laughs> hey, are you deaf? Oh, fuck. How did you sneak into the lab? It's provoke him again. My grandchildren are going to love this story. Seriously, it's a space lab. How did you get in without being noticed? It's a very valid question. Let's try the lie. A hacker guy obliterated the system controlling your emergency exit in a matter of minutes. You should work on that. It makes sense, doesn't it? I don't know. Next question. Who is your boss? Oh, shit. What happens if Ian asks? Provoke. Are you trying to bore me to death? Hobson. Savage. Tell me everything about your leader. Beg. Let's try begging. Irving, you're close to killing me. Perhaps you aren't familiar with the concept of torture. Look what time it is. We'll miss the Holistic Baseball League. Gentlemen, you'll have to excuse us. I hope you enjoyed your first session. It's been nice, Irving. Thank you for your time. Ha. This is going to be fun. Good night, fellas. Okay, where's this going? Hmm. So, you think we've been through worse than this? We're alive, aren't we? For now, let's just focus on staying that way. Okay, until when? I don't know, but as long as we're still breathing, we have a chance. Don't do or say anything stupid. We have a chance to choose our words wisely. I don't care about giving up information to us as an author, but as soon as this lunatic knows everything he wants, we're dead. Yeah, it sounds like a solid plan. Um, not really. You're selling out your dudes to keep yourself alive. A bit selfish. Shut up and get some rest. The worst is yet to come. Okay. This is interesting. Oh, they're back. Good morning. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, shit, what was that? Re ready for your next session. Oh, what? You just skipped past one? I mean, I enjoy it, but it's harsh, you know? The most difficult part is when it becomes boring. Let me tell you, designing fun torture routines is a pain in the ass. It's like an old marriage, really. <laughs> you can start thinking of new ways to surprise your little dog. Dude, chill. Chill, dude. PG-13. And without even noticing it, you end up dressed as a sailor with a strap on, banging new... Dude! <laughs> PG-13. You know I've never been married, but Alexander was. You should listen to one of his ex's stories, man. But hey, let's talk about you. Who is your leader and what is he planning? Uh, I, let me tell you. It is wild. Let's go with a think. Get some time. Oh! Fuck, dude, that looked harsh. Your leader's name is something like Crappy Rebel, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. Was that, was that a joke? Was that supposed to be a joke? Get started, I'm falling asleep here. Oh! Oh, fuck, that was a hammer. So what's your leader's name? It's just a name, it won't hurt anybody but you. Our leader is Kernsmith, also known as the Empire Destroyer. It makes sense. Okay, who do you work for? I'm going to try begging. Irving, you're close to killing me. That won't work. What's the answer? Oh, fuck! Oh, the knees! The knees and the stomach are the two most painful places to be shot. Did you know? I heard that in a film and recently? I don't, which film was it? Oh, Reservoir Dogs, of course. Please work. We are just people oppressed by the Holistic Empire, we are the resistance, and we'll overthrow your empire. Oh, we are killing it with a look here. Where are your headquarters? Dude, Burden's dying here, he needs time to recover. Come on and give it to me, baby. Well, you'll have to excuse him now. Oh, we survived, dude, we survived. We are meeting these two hot new trainees. Oh, that reminds me uh, that I'll probably kill you soon. <laughs> if the date goes smoothly, I'm going to need that chained wall. L uh, excuse me? 
Okay, let's keep it going along here. Uh, don't you ever miss having a family? I'm not that kind of man. Fighting for Cassell Federation, Esox, and Alpha. That's more than a decade of fighting. Don't you think we've gone through enough of this? You're right, you should retire um, to a nice place once you get out of this mess. Yeah, but what about you? I just don't see myself on a couch. Fair enough. Oh. What is going on here? Why are you wearing a bra? Liam. Sorry I'm so late, you didn't think Zanalfa would get you down, did you? Thanks to the gods, get us out of here. I'm sorry, but that's not a good idea. What? No shit. We are in a prison located on one of the wandering moons of the Holistic Empire. This giant rock is too heavily guarded for a prison bake. It's a mercy how I got this far. I don't think we can make it together, hell, I don't even know if we can make it back alone. Well then, grab a chair and take a seat. <laughs> What's the plan? I know you have only him. Um, you're correct. I may be a suicidal hero, but I'm not a suicidal idiot. And Alpha is preparing a rescue operation. It isn't going to be easy, but nothing withstands a clever plan. That is a uh, Tobin Bell right there. Um, what do you need us to do? I need you to endure 20 more days of torture. What? You know, clever bands usually aren't the quickest, but hey, that's why I'm here to help you in the matter. I already located a nursery above this floor. I can sneak in and steal medication for you. Medicine can restore your health, you can endure longer. Painkiller will allow you to resist more pain, so the bastard torture methods won't be as effective. But you won't recover as fast as your usual from your injuries, or if you prefer, I can gather information to help you deal with the tortures. It's easier to lie if you know what your captor is interested in. You're a smart man, Abraham, you can survive this and more. Hooray. What should I bring? Oh, fuck. Um. Right. Painkillers mean we'll heal slower, but we'll be able to endure more. Healing kit means we'll heal. Or information. I'm gonna go with information for now. To get it started. Gotcha. He could easily just bring all of them. I'm sure the nursery has painkillers and healing kits in it. 20 days, dude. You know something I envy from free guys like you? Not having to wear the same clothes every day. <laughs> and coffee. For the Emperor's sake, how I fucking miss coffee. Actually, I still want a coffee now. It was prohibited seven years ago because our beloved Emperor thought the coffee encourages rebel thinking. What a twat. Sometimes I wish that the Emperor was down here with us just so I could show him the, way, the many ways that I disagree with him. Alexander, forget what you just heard. But the thing is, rebel activity actually diminished. But so did our red departments. I don't know why you were interested in the research of some coffeeless scientists. Well, I should confess something to you, Irving. We weren't there for the coffee. No shit. I can't imagine what your idiots would like would hide. Okay, right. He didn't ask us a question though. Oh no. In the forest, an abandoned prison? Come on, tell me where you were hiding. Oh, that was the question. He said I couldn't imagine like the stuff of what you could be hiding. He didn't say, tell me what you're hiding. You'll have to sell you people to ignore later. Tell me where they are and I'll stop us suffering. Quick save, quick save, quick save. We have an office in the city. Why don't you come back? Oh, that was stupid. You have to say it like an asshole. Why do you have to joke about it? You should have just said. Seriously, do you ha even have a headquarters? I'm dead, dude. What happened to the information? What happened to the fucking information? Come from another dimension, now surrender. So oh, no. Stop! <laughs> Hey pussy, get up. Burden, answer me burden. Burden. Oh, fuck. Shit happened. Burden enjoyed 19 points of damage. Jack enjoyed 18. You confessed zero times. Your favourite request is information. Your attitude has been suicidal. <laughs> what do you mean my attitude has been suicidal? What? It takes me all the way back here? Oh, my sweet baby Jesus. It really takes you all the way back. Are you for real, dude? Oh my lord. Well, anyway, this has been Gods of Blue Watching. Um, I'm... Shit. If... 
takes you all the way back. Okay, we're gonna have to think this through a bit more. Thank you for watching. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, be sure to leave a like. If you loved it, be sure to leave a favourite and subscribe for more similar content. Other than that, my name's Vinay. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace, peace, guys.